Hi, my name is Sneaky from Cloud9, and this is my bot lane guide to Sivir Alistar. Sivir Alistar is pretty strong in solo queue, uh, mainly being the Alistar, since a lot of the times when you hit level 2, there's just the potential of him, you know, flash pulverizing and headbutting that guy back. Whenever whenever that happens, that guy is actually dead, no matter what. There's 0% chance of him living. So, that happens a lot in laning phase, it catches everyone off guard. Besides that, Sivir's, she's pretty good solo queue, uh, Maybe not the strongest because she's not a lane bully and she can't really win lane by her own means. She kind of has to rely on the enemy, you know, getting hit by too many ricochets, getting hit by too many boomerang, boomerang blades. But overall, good combo, so like you. Sivir and Alistar have some pretty okay synergy. Whenever Alistar combos, Sivir can throw out her Q. Uh, besides that, I guess another synergy would just be them both having okay laning phases and wanting to just get through it and like power to level 6 or power to ganks or big fights that are happening around the map since they're both really good both really good in those Alice are you know getting blunt, like 5 men pulverize or server speeding up her team to get to the fight faster or starting the fight stuff like that levels 1 and 2 for Silver Alistar are okay um main strongest point being Alistar is level 2 all in uh if he ever sees an opportunity to flash pulverize on anyone need the support the ad carry one of the two then that guy's actually just dead if it lands besides that can't really do much is this combo uh they don't really fight very well without you know full-on all inning because they can't sivers defensive alistar's defensive they don't really go too crazy for kills but main point just being you want to play it safe uh if the opportunity rises do go for that level two all in go for it Levels 3 to 4 for Silver Alistar are pretty strong. Um, obviously, you get all of your abilities on both Silver and Alistar, which means that Silver can start being super defensive if she didn't get uh, Spell Shield at level 2. Went for the Ricochet instead, or the Boomerang Blade. Alistar, same thing. He'll have his combo and his heal. Maybe an extra point in his heal if you're getting poked out. So, in general, you just would want to go for the nice combos with you know Alistar pull of headbutting or or in combination with that Sivir throwing out a boomerang blade to steal lots of damage uh, usually the all in is kind of okay I wouldn't recommend going too crazy for it because if Alistar ever does headbutt pull then it doesn't have vision the jungler pretty likely he's gonna get killed so be careful about it all five to six for Alistar Sivir are super strong uh, you have so much power to force things on the enemy bot lane. Specifically diving is a super strong point. Uh, you can screw it up pretty badly and get yourselves killed, but it's also really easy to get a really strong dive off because I'll start with his ulti, you know, doesn't take any damage from turrets, and then you speed up both of you and probably even the jungler to go in, go hard, get the CC off, deal tons of damage. So, Pretty strong, level 6, level 5. Playstyle for Silver Alistar is mainly just grouping with the team and getting team fights off. Alistar Silver isn't really that good at skirmishes. Uh, they need their ultis to really work effectively. Alistar will just die instantly without his ulti, and Silver, she's okay, she has some good AoE without her ulti, but really you need it to start fights and actually do big things. Matchups for Silver Alistar are kind of all over the place. Uh, I think Callista is obviously one of the worst ones. If she is with someone like Annie or some other ranged support and the Silver Alistar doesn't get the level 2 advantage, then I think Silver Alistar is just gone. Uh, they're pretty screwed over laning phase because specifically the Callista Silver matchup is pretty destruction for Callista onto the Silver because they can't really react to anything. She can't really spell shield much. Uh, it's all on the Callista to outplay the Silver, which Silver can't really do anything about. Maybe if the Alistar can stop some of it, which is pretty unlikely, or you get the level 2 and you flash pull uh, Callista in, then maybe you can win. But Besides that, it's pretty rough. Um, other matchups are okay, nothing too scary. Generally, Silver Alistar is the hardest lane to gank. Maybe there's some other harder ones, but they're extremely hard to kill. So, pretty defensive with most things. Uh, just arm it out, it'll be okay. Thank you for watching this guide to Silver Alistar. Uh, make sure you check out the rest here at lawclass.com.